complete disaster. I'm gonna be completely honest with you. So the helicopter is behind me. I brought today grass, brake cleaners, whatever you can imagine, so we can fix something. The whole thing is like shit as I went into deep uh, search today. I'm talking inside the car because we have a vacuum cleaner. The Airbnb is still working around my area and it's a total mess. I also have a small car electric pump. If we have any chance to pump the floats, but I think they are gone. Brought my ladder, my chair, tools, and uh, we are going to see what we can do with this piece of shit over here. With this piece of shit over here. I need donations. If you don't donate any money, this is not gonna work. It needs a hell of a lot of work. And we have to do this a YouTube project. So I have to make some t-shirts, some coffee cups, everything in order to gather some money. Let's see what's going to happen. Also I have my chair here. We're gonna put the chair below the helicopter. Like this. Uh, and we're gonna chill here. I went back to the place where we saved the helicopter. And guess what I found? The rest of the windows in pieces. So I have also this stuff over here. So yeah, this used to be each window before they break it. Anyway, we have a new window coming, but I'm not going to put the window anytime soon because it's gonna be destroyed. So I have to collect all the parts and then we put the new glasses on to cover it in the first place. Let's go to the destroyed interior. The throttle doesn't move at all. We have ruined it, but the blades move up and down. But we have to put some grass over there just to see what's going to happen. I don't think we have any point of doing this, but I'm trying to make the content. So gently I'm putting some WD inside the throttle gables. Oh, we have some small movement here. At least we have one door, not something. Okay. Squeeze is like hell. We knew that. Governor is still here. Ah. Oh my god. Oh my god. So I'm finding all the pieces of the windows. As I can see here. Oh my Malaka. Malaka, I found the seat belt. Fuckers. You fucking piece of shit. That's the seat belt inside. Jesus Christ. Fucking bastards, another part of the window. What the fuck did they do here? I'm gonna make the puzzle, don't worry. All for the content. Yeah. Too much mice is in here. Okay, and also I have to buy a vacuum cleaner with battery to bring it down here. Okay, let's put some WD on the throat. Let's see if it starts moving around. I'm not sure. I will leave it for a minute to chill and then I'm gonna try again. So here someone wrote the last... Uh, ah! This part was made in 1989. Someone has put a stub on it. So yeah, that's very interesting. Leave it some time to chill. And here we had, oh my God, it's so burnt that it's sitting straight. And also here, it's the other, ah, fuckers. I was searching around the area where the helicopter was. And as you can see, I think we found the whole window. Fucking idiots. That's a bit of shame. 
see what they did. Jesus Christ. And I have the other half of my truck already. Let's move in the back. I finally released the rotor brake and now it's total free. After I put some WD-40 inside here. Wait. Right. Now we are here. As you can see, that's our rotor brake over here. If I press it like this, now it moves. And also the chain moves from the side. So we managed to release this one, but I have a big suspicious that the engine is not turning. I'm not sure if the clutch is engaged or not after they remove it. The chain is on, now the chain is off, so rotor brake is now off. When it's on position down, when it's up, rotor brake is on, it's gone. Everything is gone basically, but I'm doing the gint just for the content. The air. Finally. I managed to open the first part and as you can see it has some holes so it's not necessary to remove the whole thing out. I didn't know that's why I removed it. So you unscrew it to the right and then you put air into the floats. Now the moment of truth. Let's see if it can hold air. Unbelievable. Oh coming up no way okay I'm gonna put the camera here okay this is not happening this is unbelievable okay what is this oh my god 20 years later and it holds here can you believe this nice they can hold there unbelievable So I just realized that the whole skid, the back section, it's broken. So yeah, that's another problem and also this is not good at all. Despite that we remove the engine brake, if I try to spin the rotors, they won't turn. So check this. Going over here, the steering wheel does something. I don't know what exactly, but it's supposed to be free. I'm not sure if the clutch is engaged or not, but this thing, but this thing doesn't work for sure. After the WD-40, we, we still don't have any throttle. So I assume all the cables are stuck below. This thing doesn't turn, even I put a ton of WD-40 inside. So yeah, that's a small disappointment, but something usual because this thing was in the sun, burning for 20 years and more. For the closing of this video, to be completely honest with you, I need donations. The whole YouTube project needs donations because it's a fucking mess. Every time I dig something, I always find something new. Uh, I can't support it by myself, to be completely honest, if that's what you want to hear. And now I'm sitting on the shadow, because my head is burning from the sun. After I try to put some air on the floats, and here, as you can see, it's completely done. That's it. Thanks for watching. I'm gonna put my, uh, I'm gonna put my PayPal uh, link below the video. So donate 50 cents, one dollar, and if every one of you donates from one dollar, you can gather, for example, 3,000 euros to put on this baby over here. I want to re restore it, but I can't do it without your help. So, Rebuild Rescue inspired me to do the whole process. So, if you want, just put a dollar and make this thing 
fly again. See you on the next episode.